hello YouTube welcome back to my video in this video I'm going to show you how you can search data from MySQL uh, database using a PHP frontend okay so this is a continuation of my previous video CRUD project so in the description I have put the video for that and the documents for the project okay so going back to the project so uh, this is the project the CRUD uh, so create read and update uh, delete operations using PHP and MySQL as backend so I have my uh, I have my uh, server PHP server XM server in my PC and I have these files. So these are the files of the project index page, edit page, uh, add student and DB configuration, delete and update. So I'll show you one. So I'm going to add one name here. So and the grade I'm putting it name I have uh, put has George and address I'm putting as USA okay I'm just adding it and we can see I have just added a new student with name George okay so this is my MySQL database you can see I have all uh, the same uh, data here okay and I have uh, uh, edit and uh, delete options also okay so I'm going to create a simple form here with uh, a text box uh, which can be used for searching a, a data from this table with any of these columns okay so going back to the index.php again I'm going to create a simple form here first so I have just added a simple form with uh, the form action I have not said with an input tag text and a submit button let's see uh, if I'm just uh, going to the page index you can see a search box is here so there is no functionality for that okay so I'm going to oh, submit uh, this page into a new uh, page actually I'm going to create here so so I'm going to create a new page as uh, search.php so search.php okay so here we are going to uh, set the uh, uh, the code to search that that okay so let me open this in uh, notepad plus plus and i'm going to copy the all the data currently here okay copy it from here and uh, submit in search.php and here i'm going to submit this action into search.php okay search.php okay so once this is submitted into search.php i'm i'm going to receive that uh, in, as a uh, I am submitting in method uh, get or post whatever so I'm uh, right now I'm uh, getting it as a get request so in here in this page we want to receive that uh, uh, name first okay so uh, receive that search query or whatever which we have uh, written in in that search box okay so let me write uh, the code for that so it will be like this and uh, get the variable into search like this and you can get that into uh, the variable as this and uh, the name of the variable uh, is search so just copy it as search and paste it here so I believe uh, it will work now so we have uh, uh, put a symbol get uh, URL parameter uh, as a uh, get request so this is the search a uh, search field which we have set so we can add uh, these to uh, the heading itself li like this so I'm going to update this uh, heading as search student data and uh, we can just print it like this echo search okay yes let's try this let's go to index.php now refresh so I'm going to search uh, for example John just search it here and just sub, uh, submit uh, to search button you can see it is taken to search.php okay and uh, the search value is here uh, with the name of uh, uh, the field and the values here you can see so it's updated uh, uh, to the heading here okay so before it was uh, just uh, student data so when you are submitting it it is like search student data and uh, the name of uh, the variable which we have given okay I'm going to just uh, update uh, uh, the query so the query should be like so once uh, the variable is uh, received into search 
and uh, we are calling the database connectivity as dbconfig.php okay so this is the dbconfig.php you can see uh, so the server name uh, this is the settings we have to save for the database connectivity okay so wherever you want the connection we can just call that uh, database connectivity okay now here in the SQL we are going to update it to get uh, the values based on uh, the query, uh, the field which you have uh, submitted okay. once uh, the values received into search we can we have to set this um, variable into the query so we have to update the query so as we are uh, using the like operator uh, we'll have to update uh, the value of our search field like this I'll show you how so you will have to put uh, this percentage symbol here okay so uh, uh, before and after like this okay so as you know uh, like uh, the query for searching is like uh, this I'll show you here I'm going to query a symbol uh, search query here so select star from student word name like so it should be like this you have to set uh, the value inside this okay so I'm uh, putting it as J okay so if I'm just searching you can see the names which have the letter J will come here okay so if you want to uh, search a value starting with uh, J you can remove this uh, percentage symbol from uh, the first like this if I'm just searching you can see only uh, the name starting with j will come okay so to match uh, anywhere you have to put percentage uh, in both sides okay so that we are doing it uh, here right here okay so once it is received you can uh, set it into the query okay so select star from uh, student were name like so we have to set uh, uh, the search field here so i'm going to set it like this copy can copy from here Paste it here, okay. And if you want to check the address, also you can just uh, specify uh, the address field like this address, like okay, yes, that's all. So it will check uh, in a uh, name column and address column like this, okay. Now, yes, let's go now. Going to index page, so I'm going to search uh, this uh, any of. Uh, the name so I'm uh, going to search as AH let's see which all data is coming so if I'm just searching you can see AH is coming which means uh, the search uh, is working and uh, the value of uh, mm, uh, with name matching with AH is coming okay now I'm going to search with uh, USA let's see what is coming if I'm just searching you can see there is uh, two values with USA okay so yes it's working now i'm just uh, searching with a value j only so it will take all the names or uh, uh, ad, uh, the address field with uh, j inside the if i'm just searching you can see uh, this all name is having j okay which means search operation is completed and it's working well okay so hope you got this how you can search a data from uh, mysql database with the uh, front end as uh, php okay so i'll share the source code in my description you can have it and uh, please like and subscribe for my videos and thanks for watching